in this demonstration, we'll show how you can extract signatures from uh, contracts or banking documents using image processing profiles with triggers in SiteCapture's QA auto processing. Let's go ahead and start a capture process. And what we're going to do is bring in a banking signature card. And that signature card is going to have two signatures. So if we import this signature card, bring it into the application, you can see that we've got a, a signature in block one and block two. So if I come in and zoom, you can see we've got a, a signature, John Hancock and Thomas Jefferson sign this document. And uh, what we want to do is extract these signatures by cropping them and output them either to a document management system, or in this case, what we're going to do is send them to um, a specified output structure so they can be imported into SQN Sentry, which is a signature verification product. So let's go ahead and move on through the process here. My next step is indexing. And in indexing, I'm going to be prompted to enter an account number. And then you can see what our product does is it focuses in on these signature blocks and looks to see if there's a signature within. And it does that for each of the blocks. And you can see that one and two register is being signed. And three is actually blank. So there's no, uh, no extraction required for that particular zone. Now what QA auto processing is going to do, it's going to do, uh, it's going to look for the word signed in that field for each of the particular signature blocks. And if it finds it, it's going to extract that signature and output it into a folder. So in the output folder, I've got image files and then I've got text output files. And we'll talk about those in a second. But in the image file, Site Capture actually auto crops the signature field. Okay, so here's John Hancock's. And then if we open up the second signature block, you'll see that we've got Thomas Jefferson's uh, chicken scratch there. Okay, so it automatically crops and dumps those to a directory. And then it actually outputs into a specified format, in this case for SQN Sentry. Obviously, not all the fields are listed. Uh, but we could also output to SharePoint or pretty much any other document management system. So real flexible usage of that uh, image auto processing and image profiles that can make it very simple to do complex tasks. If you have any questions, contact your reseller or send a note to sales at Thanks.